2017 Mitsubishi Mirage. The styling of the Mirage has never been one of the first things to be criticized about the car, but this shouldn't be taken to mean that it is in any way good. There are bigger problems with the car than the way it looked, but even just looking at it, you can tell that you're in for a no-frills sort of an experience. This has changed with the facelift, and the Mirage is now much more attractive. It is a huge improvement over the current styling, with most of the changes focusing on the front fascia. There is a new grille, new headlights, a new bumper and a new hood. Around back there is a new bumper, spoiler and redesigned lights. The Mirage has been given a new set of much better looking wheels, and all of these combine to give the car a look that is far less aggressively cheap. The interior of the Mirage has faced a lot of criticism, and Mitsubishi has changed the seat fabric and the steering wheel as an answer to the those saying the current versions are cheap and unpleasant. The gauges and shift panel have been redesigned as well, and this is again an improvement. But the most important part of the interior is the infotainment system, which now includes an optional 300W Rockford Fosgate stereo system. The Mirage will also now offer both Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, a first for any Mitsubishi. Of course, those are options, and the difference will be less noticeable on the base model, but at least there is a choice now. What is worrying is that there is no mention of sound deadening for the new car. The cabin noise in the current car is much worse than in its competitors, and this will probably carry over.